I think the danger of AI is much greater than the danger of nuclear warheads by a lot. Have you ever wondered what might happen if we combine two groundbreaking technologies, AI and quantum computers? Recently, the US government made a surprising move urging Google and NASA to pause their quantum computer development efforts. This action echoes the concerns of renowned physicist Michio Koku, who has been warning about the potential consequences for years. Today, let's delve into the truth about the convergence of quantum computers and AI. We're talking about a powerful alliance between software and hardware, chatbots, the revolution in software, and quantum computers, the revolution in hardware. When these two come together, it's a game-changer. Quantum computers operate on the principles of quantum mechanics, unlike traditional computers. Instead of using bits as zeros or ones, they work with qubits. These qubits can hold information as both zero and one simultaneously, thanks to a phenomenon called superposition. Qubits are the rock stars of the quantum computer world. They can exist in multiple states simultaneously, thanks to their superposition powers. This means quantum computers can process complex calculations in parallel, potentially speeding things up exponentially compared to classical computers. But that's not all. Quantum computers also leverage entanglement, another mind-blowing phenomenon. When qubits are entangled, the state of one qubit becomes linked to the state of another, no matter how far apart they are. Quantum computers aren't your typical machines, they harness the extraordinary abilities of qubits to compute things in an entirely different league. Traditional computers use classical bits and can only go step by step, either zero or one. But quantum computers tap into superposition and entanglement to process loads of information simultaneously on a galactic scale. The roots of this quantum revolution trace back to the early 20th century when quantum theory emerged. Scientists have been on a thrilling endeavor to unlock the true potential of quantum computing ever since. Quantum theory brought a whole new perspective to physics, turning classical physics upside down and inside out. Max Planck's radical idea in 1900 proposed that energy comes in discrete packets called quanta, laying the groundwork for understanding that particles like electrons can only exist at specific energy levels. Then, Werner Heisenberg's uncertainty principle in 1925 added to the quantum commotion, stating that we can't know the exact position and momentum of a particle simultaneously. In 1935, Albert Einstein, Boris Podolsky, and Nathan Rosen raised the EPR paradox, suggesting spooky action at a distance, where entangled particles seem to communicate faster than light, no matter how far apart they are. This notion of quantum teleportation gave rise to scientific goosebumps. But the real breakthrough came in 1980 when the concept of quantum computing emerged. Physicist Paul Benioff envisioned a new breed of computers harnessing the power of quantum mechanics. Quantum systems could perform mind-blowing computational tasks, making traditional computers seem slow in comparison. In the same year, physicist Richard Feynman expanded on Benioff's ideas, seeing the potential of quantum computers to solve problems that classical computers couldn't touch. This marked the beginning of the quantum computing fever that continues to shape the future of technology. Feynman's visionary thinking sparked a surge of curiosity in the scientific community, laying the foundation for further exploration in quantum computing. In the following decades, researchers delved into the intricacies of quantum mechanics, striving to grasp the principles underlying this technology. In 1994, Peter Scheer, a math wizard, unveiled a groundbreaking algorithm that unveiled the true potential of quantum computers. This algorithm enabled quantum computers to factor large numbers at a speed unimaginable for classical computers. The year 1998 marked a significant milestone with the creation of the first practical quantum computer crafted by a team at the Los Alamos National Laboratory. This two-qubit quantum computer utilized sophisticated nuclear magnetic resonance techniques, setting the stage for future advancements. Moving into the early 2000s, multiple research groups and companies pushed the boundaries of quantum computing. In 2001, IBM introduced the IBM Qubit, a five-qubit quantum computer that astonished scientists and tech enthusiasts alike. However, quantum computers face challenges with quantum error correction, qubits being delicate and interacting with their environment, risking the loss of quantum information. To address this, researchers develop codes like the surface code to safeguard quantum information, enhancing the reliability of quantum computers. 
In 2005, researchers at the University of Innsbruck and NIST achieved a breakthrough by assembling a functional quantum computer with 5 qubits. Though seemingly modest, this achievement represented a significant leap forward, demonstrating the feasibility of practical quantum computers. Further progress was made in 2007 when scientists at Yale University devised methods to create stable qubits using solid-state systems. This innovation paved the way for more stable and user-friendly quantum computers. In 2010, the University of Science and Technology of China achieved a milestone in quantum teleportation, showcasing the potential for building quantum networks capable of transmitting quantum information over great distances. In 2013, Google and NASA embarked on a collaboration to develop the D-Wave 2, a groundbreaking quantum computer. However, their efforts were hampered by government intervention, halting the project's progress and leaving its future uncertain. The government shutdown disrupted NASA's testing and exploration of this exciting technology, leading to lost time and missed opportunities. Despite being powered and ready, the D-Wave 2 remained idle, unable to fulfill its potential due to the uncertainty surrounding the project's future. The passionate individuals dedicated to the project felt a sense of disappointment when progress hit a roadblock. However, the story doesn't end there. With government operations back on track, the D-Wave 2 quantum computer and the dream of exploring the quantum frontier are poised for a resurgence. In 2019, Google made waves with a remarkable achievement, quantum supremacy. They unveiled the mighty Sycamore quantum processor to tackle a mathematical problem that would have stumped classical computers for thousands of years. This breakthrough demonstrated the unparalleled power of quantum computers, inspiring other tech giants like IBM and Microsoft to intensify their efforts in quantum computing. IBM's introduction of the IBM Quantum System 1 in 2020 marked a significant milestone. It was the first fully integrated quantum computer designed for commercial use, making quantum computing more practical and accessible. This sparked a surge of interest and investment in quantum computing research worldwide, with governments and industries recognizing its game-changing potential. As quantum computing research flourished, governments provided funding for groundbreaking initiatives, leading to the establishment of quantum research centers and labs. These became hubs for collaboration between academia, industry, and government agencies, driving innovation in quantum technology. In the quest for extraterrestrial intelligence, scientists have pondered the Fermi paradox, which questions why we haven't found clear evidence of intelligent life elsewhere in the universe. One intriguing hypothesis suggests that advanced alien civilizations might be using black holes as powerful supercomputers. Since 1960, scientists have searched for extraterrestrial intelligence by scanning the cosmos for radio signals. However, some researchers advocate expanding the search to include other signs of technology, such as directed energy, neutrinos, quantum communications, and gravitational waves. A study by Jed Valley and Zaza Osmanov explores the idea of large-scale quantum computing as a potential clue to finding advanced alien civilizations. Quantum computing offers lightning-fast information processing and near-impenetrable security, making it an attractive choice for advanced civilizations. The researchers proposed that hypothetical black holes, possibly created by advanced aliens, could serve as ideal platforms for quantum computing. These miniature black holes would emit intense radiation, including Hawking radiation, which could be a telltale sign of advanced alien civilizations. Hawking radiation, named after physicist Stephen Hawking, consists of tiny particles, including high-energy neutrinos, which could serve as carriers of information. This radiation could be detected as evidence of advanced alien technology. Overall, the study suggests that black holes could be the cosmic hubs for advanced quantum computing by extraterrestrial civilizations. High-energy neutrinos may originate from both the Hawking radiation emitted by small black holes and the particle collisions involved in their creation. To detect these cosmic signals, the IceCube Observatory, nestled deep within Antarctica's ice, plays a crucial role. It could serve as a vital instrument in identifying the telltale signs of advanced technology, potentially unlocking the mystery of the Fermi paradox. The groundbreaking theory proposes that advanced civilizations may have progressed beyond traditional radio and digital communication, utilizing black holes as quantum supercomputers. This could explain why we haven't detected their technology yet.
Moreover, with the rapid advancement of computing, they might only use radio signals for a limited period, aligning with the L parameter in the Drake equation, representing how long civilizations actively transmit detectable signals into space. Renowned theoretical physicist Michio Koku, known for his ability to elucidate complex scientific concepts, recently explored the intersection of AI and quantum computing. He highlighted how quantum computers could verify the accuracy of information generated by AI systems, potentially enhancing reliability. However, Dr. Koku expressed concerns about the potential misuse of this fact-checking capability by governments to manipulate information and suppress opposing viewpoints. Quantum computing presents a double-edged sword for society. While it holds immense potential for societal benefits, misuse could lead to manipulation and control of information. The rapid progress in AI has raised concerns about deep fakes, biased decision-making, and misinformation. Scientists worldwide are diligently working towards building ultimate quantum computers, employing gate-based and adiabatic approaches. However, challenges such as maintaining quantum coherence and creating highly controlled environments persist. Creating and maintaining the precise conditions required for quantum computers is both challenging and expensive, akin to walking a tightrope. Error correction is vital in quantum computing, as errors can accumulate over time and degrade the accuracy of results. Despite the complexities involved, governments, academic institutions, and private companies are joining forces to invest heavily in quantum research and development initiatives. Leading entities like IBM Quantum, Google Quantum AI, and Microsoft Quantum are providing researchers worldwide with access to top-notch quantum hardware, software, and educational resources. Continuous innovation in quantum algorithms and software is propelling us closer to realizing the full potential of quantum computing. Quantum computers hold immense promise across various fields, serving as cosmic superheroes capable of tackling optimization problems, machine learning, cryptography, and drug discovery with unparalleled efficiency. In the realm of space exploration, quantum computers offer invaluable support by enhancing simulations and modeling of astronomical phenomena enabling more precise planning of space missions and improved safety for cosmic voyages. Moreover, quantum cryptography ensures secure communication channels, protecting sensitive information during space missions. Quantum mechanics endows quantum computers with remarkable phenomena like entanglement and quantum tunneling, which could revolutionize spacecraft propulsion systems and open new horizons in space exploration. In the military domain, quantum computers act as cosmic code breakers, strengthening secure communications and enhancing battlefield analysis with real-time data processing. Quantum sensors improve target detection and tracking, while quantum communication ensures secure data transmission, empowering informed decision-making on the cosmic battlefield. However, along with their potential benefits, quantum computers pose challenges, particularly concerning encryption systems. Secure communication protocols rely on the complexity of factoring large numbers, which could be compromised by the parallel computation capabilities of quantum computers. Thus, while quantum computing holds immense promise for scientific breakthroughs and military advancements, mitigating potential threats and addressing challenges remains crucial for maximizing its benefits. Classical computers provide a robust layer of security through encryption, making confidential information like financial records or classified data relatively secure. However, the advent of quantum computers introduces a new challenge. Algorithms like Shear's algorithm, specifically designed for quantum computers, have the potential to quickly factor large numbers, breaking conventional encryption schemes. If quantum computers fall into the wrong hands, confidential information could become vulnerable to malicious attacks, posing significant risks to data privacy and security. Cryptocurrencies relying on cryptographic algorithms for transactions and currency integrity are also at risk. Quantum computers could potentially undermine the trust and reliability of cryptocurrencies by breaking these algorithms. To address these encryption challenges, scientists and experts worldwide are developing new cryptographic methods known as post-quantum cryptography to defend against potential quantum threats. This ongoing battle between quantum computers and encryption underscores the importance of securing our data and digital economy. Moreover, the security of the Internet, relying heavily on public key cryptography, faces threats from quantum computers. 
sensitive information could be exposed, leading to rampant cyber attacks and undermining the trustworthiness of online interactions. Data privacy is also under scrutiny as quantum computers could unravel patterns hidden within encrypted data sets, raising concerns about privacy breaches and the need for regulatory frameworks. Furthermore, quantum computers pose risks to scientific simulations and models. Their computational power could compromise the integrity of simulations, impacting fields like material science, drug discovery, and climate modeling. Unauthorized access to sensitive information or tampering with results could significantly impact scientific research and decision-making processes. To mitigate these risks, proactive measures such as post-quantum cryptography are being developed to protect against quantum threats. However, transitioning to these new encryption methods requires careful planning and coordination to ensure the security of existing systems. Investments in quantum-resistant technologies and encryption standards are crucial to staying ahead of potential threats. Collaboration between governments and organizations is essential to establishing robust solutions and regulatory frameworks safeguarding sensitive data from quantum vulnerabilities. Thanks for watching you know.